welcome to my channel hope you all are doing good before we start with this i would like to request my new viewers to consider subscribing to my channel also please click on the bell icon so that you will get notified as soon as i upload a new video let's get started as a first step i am going to mix a little bit of water to the glue and then make it as a fine paste Apply this glue in the glass bottle and then stick the tissue paper one by one. This is to form a texture in the bottle. Stick it all over the bottle. Make sure you are covering the entire glass bottle with the tissue paper. Once you are done with that, apply the second coat of glue on top of it. The second coat of glue will just to make the bonding so strong. Once it's done dry it completely, it will take 24 to 48 hours to dry it completely. I have drawn an outline of tree and a peacock. Taking an aluminum foil and then going to crush it to form the shape of my outline. I am going to do the same thing for the tree trunk. Now the peacock's upper body and the tree trunks are ready. Stick it using the hot glue. Once you are done watching this, please do comment your views on it. It will be very useful for me to work on my next project. Once again, I request my new viewers to consider subscribing to my channel. Also, please click on the bell icon so that you will get notified as soon as I upload a new video. Now, let's start doing the clay work. I am using a hair dry clay here. Roll the clay and then cut it to a bird shape. Stick it using white glue. Stick it perfect to the shape. Adjust the shape and take out any extra clay. I am using my clay carving knife here. Use water to smoothen the surface. Now I am going to stick the wing part. Forming some texture over the wings. You can do it as you wish. I just want to make it look dense. I am sticking the beak now and the eyes. Now preparing the clay for the feather part. Stick the feathers one by one in a row from the bottom to the top. Once you are done with sticking one row, do your design. Make some texture and then stick the next row. I am making a design like this. Do the same thing again and again until you reach the top of it. And here your peacock is ready. Now going to stick the tree trunks. It's okay to stick the clay bit by bit. But make sure you use water to smoothen the surface. Take out any extra clay. Adjust the shape nicely. I am using water to smoothen the surface now. Form a nice texture for the tree. I am just making uneven lines here and there. Now doing the leaf part, taking an impression of the silicone mold, cutting out the extra clay. Now the leaf is ready, stick it to the bottle. Do the same thing again and again. Now the tree is ready. I am forming a bottle lid using the clay. Adjust the shape using water. I 
make some lines to do some design. Now the clay part is done, let it dry completely before we start painting. I am using all acrylic colors here, color blue for the background. One take brown for the tree trunks. For the maple leaves, I want it to look the autumn themed one. So I am using three colors here. Scarlet red, orange and yellow orange. First you can do with the red. And orange now. As a middle part of the leaf and for the top you can use yellow once you are done with painting use water and then match all the three colors so that it will look nicer now metallic blue for peacock's body Metallic copper for the wing and crown. Yellow for the beak. Metallic green as a base coat for the feathers. Now metallic gold for the lid. Metallic copper as a second layer of feather. Third layer as metallic blue. Eyes are golden. I am using metallic gold to highlight the leaves and the tree trunk. Also metallic gold for highlighting the background. It's done. Now I'm giving a lemon yellow as another layer of highlight. Metallic copper again for the tree trunks to highlight as a second layer. And the beautiful peacock themed bottle craft is ready now. Please let me know your views. Hope you all like it. Thank you for watching.